cartridge review of the Cricut Cartridge Sophisticated. I am absolutely loving this cartridge. It's a regular Cricut cartridge is not an Imagine cartridge, but it um, is by Teresa Collins, which is why it's in a slightly different packaging, and it kind of does look like an Imagine cartridge when you see it like that. But anyway. Your main image broken into the two pieces. So that's your pink part, and then there's the grey part. And then in this cartridge we have phrase, a border, a font, in this case we're showing a number, font 2, um, that one's got a shift key, uh, font 2 shadow, so you've got font 2 has got two elements to it and then you've got the shadow and then you've got the base and the phrase shadow, so you've got the shadow for this and the shadow for that in this bit here. So a really, really nice cartridge. Lots and lots on this. Okay, so I'm going to have to keep this sort of further back because it's just so much to show you on each page. So they're really lovely, elegant swatch scrolls. You've got a lot of beautiful borders, a really, really nice font. I mean, the font here with the um, frame around, it's really cool. And then you've got this accent piece and your word. So this one is a definite must have for me. And I like the fact that the sort of shift key on here is showing something completely different. And these main images are so pretty and the words are really interesting as well and the borders are just, I mean there's just so much that go on. And then we've got here is a chandelier and a lovely lovely border there another chandelier another chandelier again and the words are really nice as well I think these would particularly be useful for your scrapbook pages on the words nice. I like the way that that's sort of like that and then you have the more straight traditional S on there. And you know what I'm like with my borders, I do love the borders, pun um, punches and the cartridges. More chandelier. Beautiful key. But again look, you could just use the top piece all by itself, it would just make a lovely frame or just anything really, it's just a really pretty image on its own. And now we've got a second part to the font. So we've got the first actual letter. So in the font set one, we've now got a small letter and a capital letter. Obviously with the numbers, it was remaining blank, but now we've got past that, we're now having that. And the same with font two, we're getting the capitals. So in font two, we were getting like brackets or whatever and exclamation marks. Um, and now we're on small letters and capitals, okay. Mother, I don't know if you can see, I'll bring it a little bit closer. Is on that font there the little detailing on there? which would be really nice and then you've got the same with the frame so we've got all the different family members there and that's a door I actually hadn't spotted it before, or I didn't remember I'd spotted. And that says, uh, family is forever. And that's a lovely heart border there, and then you've got the middle piece to go in, into the border, the extra piece. See, sometimes you don't get 
certain bits don't include, they don't have the extras in the shift key, some do. And then you've got your key hole. The little things in life, it says. And a gorgeous chair, and that's his treasure. That's a beautiful border, I like that. I'm really, really liking this cartridge, but then I think you guys know I like the more kind of traditional things like this. I really like this sort of thing. This is uh, a lovely chair. I've cut this, and it's really, really nice. Home sweet home. I love this fleur de -lis. Another fleur de -lis, different sort. And again, I just love these borders. That's a nice border, I like that. Nice crown. I like the detailing in that lot of tradition now. It says that only needs to be cut at three inches, and don't forget it's three inches high, so you know it's very much t shorter than it is wide. So you're probably looking at three by five, three by five and a half, something like that. And this is where I like my gypsy because you can see the sizing of it, and I guess the same with the E2, you can see what it looks like on the mat. And I guess also with the Imagine. As you can see it on the virtual screen whereas with the regular Cricut expression which I love I'm I'm trying to make myself use my imagine more just for my regular cuts but I do love my regular expression a little, it's like a little partridge almost it's a little crown on the top so you could use the crown just on its own and this board is beautiful so there's a few things missing on this one now because it's run out of fonts. Pretty little flower. Cherry blossom. Very pretty scrolly, that would look lovely on a card or along the bottom of a scrap page. A lovely flourish. Okay, and then a clock. It's just like a zigzag there, that's quite cute. Stopwatch type clock. And oh, look, I didn't know that was there. Well, perhaps I did, I don't know now. Little banner, anyway. I think so the problem is when you're using your gypsy, you don't always re register where it's come from because you can't do a search or whatever. And there's a nice selection of numbers. I think it's a shame that there's not things in there, but and then a pattern. As you can see, there's a lot, lot, lot on here. Lovely frame. Another kind of arched frame. That's pretty. Nice corners, photo corners, that would make lovely photo corners, some nice mats and things. Nice little top note. Very sweet. More frames. Again, those corners would come in handy, I think, to make your photo look pretty on your, 
on your scrapbook pages or even use them on as corners for your images on your cards. I've done that. I, just, I think it looks quite sweet. And these almost look like mirrors. You could use those for mirrors. Put like mirror board behind. More banners. That's nice. Like that. Okay, that would look nice over a photograph. And then you come to the last pages, which are just your summary. So that is the one beautiful, sophisticated cartridge. I hope you've enjoyed having a look through that with me. And I hope you like it as much as I do, because I think this is a fabulous cartridge. Thanks for watching, everyone, and I'll see you all again soon. Bye!